Nelson Island. Are you ready for our adventure on Nelson Island, the lost Gulf Island? En route to the island, we almost lost a drone, Maggie relaxed, Papa Mike did some laundry, and then when we got stern anchored, which was a bit of an issue, we found a secret waterfall, we did some cliff diving, the kids went swimming, Janice bathed in the waterfall, and of course, we did some fishing with success this time. So sit back, sit tight, and enjoy the adventure. Welcome on board, Tangaroa. Where are we going? We are going to Green Bay on Nelson Island. Nelson Island is allegedly the forgotten Gulf Islands I'm not many people go about. And it is halfway up a Jemimim, I can't even say it, a Gemimimon. Um, yeah, that place. So, yeah, it's gonna be a cool. We're gonna, it's a perfect day to cross the strait. And uh, yeah, look at it. This is the perfect day to cross the strait of Georgia. Or the Salish Sea. So it's time to pull anchor and head out. I mean, we didn't lose anything, but it just didn't, it didn't want to fly forward. So we just had to just jump into the tender and go rescue our drone. It was just hovering way the heck behind us. Okay. It was actually quite funny because, and on the way, massive humpback came up. So we were waiting for the humpback to come back up again. Well, it came up again while they're up here. Yeah. I love whales. Oh, I just saw him. I don't think it's a humpback, Janice. I think they're just dolphins. Oh, no, this oh, no, was, that a was a humpback. Oh, humpback. Oh, oh, humpback. These are, these are right porpoises over here. It came up over there, and it you can see his back and then his tail go up. Oh. Go down. Yeah. There they are. Right here. Straight off our bow. Oh, it's a little baby, guys. Yeah. Oh wait, we've got kids waking up. Did we miss them? Well, they were right around here. They might come up again, you just have to wait. Come sit. They're humpbacks. We are just about to round the tip of Texada. Ooh, there's a big boat that just came up from behind it. This is the southern tip of Texada Island. We're just about to go around. And it's an absolutely stunning day. I gotta go back to driving. I really should pay more attention. I come out to video and we start like, oh, go on left. Okay. Okay, pay attention, Janice. Serious stuff here. ask us what it's like to travel with a dog. Well, we keep her vaccination records up to date, so she's got a rabies shot and stuff, but let me show you where she likes to ride. Right there. That's her spot. It makes it not so comfortable for the captain, 
I'm thinking maybe we should put something right up here for her, but she likes to be right here when we're underway. She's nice and safe, and I guess she feels secure there. But um, no, she's a really good traveler. I highly recommend traveling with dogs. They're amazing, if you ask me. Here we are, just coming into the entrance of Agamemnon, so I can't even say it, Agamemnon Channel. So we're going to head up there, and our anchorage is about 40 minutes ahead. Agamemnon, Agamemnon. We're just entering into the channel. We've got uh, doing some laundry aboard here. That's our. Uh, Handy dandy drying rack. How's that rack working? Working good. <laughs> As well, we're filming too. Drying our clothes on the way into uh, Agamemnon Channel here. Yeah. Okay, so I just pulled in the tender. We are going to go stir line to shore, so I gotta figure that out. And it's going in the tender, so I'm gonna have to get the engine down as soon as we get situated. But right now it's back up to check out the anchor situation. The journey into Green Bay, Nelson Island was absolutely beautiful. Everything was going well, I was taking the stern line to shore, and then the shit hit the fan. I screwed up by putting the stern line around a rock that seriously tangled moved like it was a pebble. And then the rock rolled down right onto my leg. I scraped up my leg a bit, but that was nothing of what could have happened. My leg could have been broken. But we regrouped and I put the stern line on a big tree that there's no way Tangra was going to pull out of the ground. Then Papa Mike and I found a place to take the dogs on shore so they could go for a pee. Going in. graceful than I am. I just do a flop. After dumping off Papa Mike and Cooper, it was time to grab the kids and head out to do some gunk holing. I want to see how we can see the waterfall. Oh, we're exploring. We're explorers. Woohoo! Oh, girls! Come check this out. Oh, get in here. Check this out! Come in! Just walk, it's not slippery right there! Wow! This is like, oh, I can't believe no one else is coming with me to see this. It is so beautiful! I love these hidden treasures, like, I'm just like, oh, just wow! And look at this! There's a big tree going all the way down. There's lots of little cabins and homesteads around here. I don't think anybody's at them right now, but yeah, we're cruising. 
saw a really cool waterfall. We're just gonna look at around the shore. Jump off point, uh, Princess Louisa. It's a good jump off point for Princess Louisa. Yeah. That's a nice house. I can there. You can live there. I can live there. I have a basketball net. That's the best place to pay a net basketball in the water there. I'm blind. It's great to get from the dock. I'm blind. This is beautiful. This looks like an old dock in here. Look at the purple starfish. Or an old ship. Even, oh, it could maybe. be an old boat. It's all curved. Could be a shipwreck. It's like they're totally in the dock out in the front It does look like the Moai. You're right. I think it's a Moai, Blaine. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> okay. It's our mac and cheese. Maybe we should dump our kids on this dock. Uh, no. No. They want to go jump off the cliffs. Let's do this. Let's do it. somewhere. I'm gonna go jump off there. Okay, I'm gonna make... <laughs> okay, how'd I get up here? Woo! <laughs> I'm not very good at rock climbing. You can do it! Okay, this is cool. It's just a little jump. Huh? It's just a wee jump. Yeah. <laughs> I'm a bit scared. Are you ready? ready. One, two, three. <laughs> Woohoo! Woo! I'm ready. How was that? Woohoo! Woo! Uh, uh, he's very graceful. Uh, Woo! Nothing but grace and agility. That was awesome. So no one else wants to cliff jump with me, but that was so much fun. And I was hot, but uh, yeah. 50 year old woman jumping off a cliff, you yeah. know, Body conscious and all, whatever. Blaine's <laughs> a little cold nature. Blaine doesn't do cold water well. No, that's the problem. Blaine was raised in St. Thomas. No, cold water is not my forte. Thing. Maggie, see, she steps. Where do you want to go? She seems to be pretty happy up here. Well, it doesn't look super safe. I think so. Come on. No, I totally think it doesn't look very safe. So this is kind of cool, we're on an old dock here that were used by the loggers, but this is unfortunate. Look at all the styrofoam, and all that styrofoam is going to go into the water. It's all getting broken up into little pieces. It's horrible. What do you think, Megs? Come on back, Maggie. We should go get flip flops. I'll go show you that waterfall. And I'll rinse off in there. 
Or we could get the dog back. Being pet by wet hands. Hey, why are you recording me? <laughs> Hello, Megs. <laughs> How's the swim? Good. Big old wet pets. You having fun? Yeah. The water's nice, eh? Yeah. You should have jumped off a cliff. <laughs> I call it over, Mom. <laughs> oh no. Get down fast! We're going to the waterfall. Stepped on a barnacle oh. top. That's okay, I can fix it. Oh, his nose! Oh, his nose! Oh, there we go. Ready? Woo! That looks really cold. Dump their outhouses. They do not. You go under. No. I don't wanna. Go under. I don't wanna. Uh. Isn't it cold? Hey Blaine, will you get in the waterfall if I'm naked? I said I would think harder about it if she was naked. He still wouldn't get in. So uh, that's the problem with a boy born in or like raised in St. Thomas. He's not like he hates cold water. Oh wow, that was so much fun. Woo! Woo! Okay, now we gotta get back without killing her. I like my version better. What? I broke my one flip flop and stepped on a barnacle top. Stepped in a water. Oh, 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 it's a snake! Cling! What is a snake? Look at that! Look at it's a little garter snake. Hi, little guy. I think you're scaring the poop out of him. Probably. He's so cute, though. Where'd he go? He did from me. So he got to me. Where is he? Mm -hmm. He found a hole to hide in. He's under there somewhere. We'll leave them. We couldn't believe how much fish were in this bay, so it was time to head back to the boat, grab the fishing rods, and see what we could catch. You ready? <laughs> what are you laughing at my fish? Woohoo! You might be able to you might be able to put your fish on and uh catch I got a fish! fish. <laughs> that looked like your bait, didn't it? <laughs> and that's exactly what happened. My little fish became bait to catch something bigger. Are you stuck on the bottom? It's not the bottom, Blaine. Oh my goodness. And it's not the bottom. He immediately got chomped as soon as we got down. <laughs> oh, what, do, what do we got this time? It is not the bottom. <laughs> 
<laughs> hey girlie, I was just fishing too early. I had to wait to dusk. No, you just didn't have bait. Woohoo! Wow! Whoa. Oh, you got a shark, shark Janice. No, this is a dogfish. Is, it, is that a dogfish? Yeah. I need the net. That looks like a shark. Oh my goodness. Oh my god. That looks like a shark, Mom. I don't know. I think that's a shark. You don't have. Oh! Oh, oh I oh. broke. It took my lure. <laughs> he took Kenny. He took my lure, though. <laughs> Mom, don't got a lure. No. <laughs> and your bait. Did you get him though? I on got, video? I think I got him, yeah. Oh.